Hello there kids, it is I, Strike Hat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Fallout 4. Alright, when we left off, we had just cleared out this little place on our way to the Corvega plant, and uh, discovered a little bit of shady operations have been going on here for quite some time. Didn't quite check the computer up here though, because there was quite a scene up here. Uh, in case all of y'all couldn't really tell, oh, dog meat found something. What'd you find? Really? You found the thing I had already ignored. Thank you, dog meat. You lovable oaf. Jeez. Uh, if you couldn't really tell from the way this looked, uh, yeah. Shot themselves from the look of it. From the angle of the chair and the splatter of the blood. Yeah. Anyway, let's look at the station master's terminal. Find out what went on here. A critical failure in the track switching system has been detected. Please clear the tracks. Well, that's not going to happen, is it? Spotlight control plate. Oh, I can pull out the tape and play it myself. Okay. It's good to know. Uh, where is the tape? Uh, where did I just put the thing? God damn. I always lose things that I pull out the computers. A Bedford station recording. There we are. It's half past. She's late. A951. No. Something's wrong. Uh. Someone's coming. Look. Five of them. It's a trap. Damn it. They've got us surrounded. What do we do? Uh. Me a count of ten, then uh, break for the tree line. What, uh, Dutchman? I. There's no time. Good luck, A9. A9. Ten. Why was that in the computer? Why was that in the computer? Huh. So, Dutchman died fighting someone. It wasn't just the ghouls. Or maybe it was the ghouls. They mistook it as a trap. Okay, dog meets AI is being weird. But they mistook it as a trap when it was actually ghouls, maybe. And these symbols means something, or it has to mean something, to do with the railroad, maybe. Because A9 doesn't sound like a normal designation. Well, it would be a designation for a robot, probably. You know, like R2-D2, C-3PO. But that doesn't seem like someone would actually name them that of their own accord. Unless they're absolutely weird, but... Besides the point. Has to have something to do with the railroad we've been hearing about. Okay. Well. Maybe it wasn't so shady after all. Just told to break for the tree line. and Tree lines on both sides. So I don't know what that means. Huh. Anyway. I'm going to keep this out simply because there's still ghouls about, I think. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Uh, can we get up here? Yeah, we can. There's nothing up here, though, so I don't know why I did that. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Cap stash. Nice. Nuka-Cola. I'll take that. Uh, railway spike. Well, that kind of confirms it. For me, at least. It's definitely a railroad operation. Because uh, I think, if I recall correctly, uh, the only faction to have the railway rifle, which would take those spikes would be the railroad which makes sense considering uh the name kind of makes it oh i did not even see the train i've never even seen the train holy shit yeah that tree is definitely in the way there's no way that thing's getting out of here but holy shit that looks pretty damn cool definitely a sort of futuristic sort of take 
and the modern engines we have now. Okay, that notification is going to get me annoyed, so I might as well just level up now. There we go. Uh, did I say what I was going to dump it into? Because <laughs> I don't recall if I did. Uh, balls. Now, water is your ally. You no longer take radiation damage from swimming and can breathe on the water. That's actually a really cool perk. It's actually really that I think 40% of the entire map of Fallout 4 is basically water. So, that actually would help out a lot. So, we might as well throw that into an endurance. So that way we can get the perk after. I just want to look at everything else going on. Local leader, I will definitely need to throw another perk into Charisma just to get that unlocked. And... Actually, probably two. So I can get Party Boy. Because then it'll match me. <laughs> Alright. Uh, how much ammo do I got currently? Uh, didn't really take that much of a dent in all that fighting. Uh, took maybe 50 rounds tops. So, we're good on that front. For the time being, anyway. Now, we go down to the Corvega plant. I still have no visibility. That's going to be a problem. Oh, we got several obstructions in the way of this track. Did I just hear a Brahmin? I did. What's a bunch of Brahmin doing here? The hell? Well, I mean, I'm not gonna shoot them because there's no point, but... Really? Huh. It's like roving bands of Brahmin on their own. Okay. I mean, I guess... That's how it works now. Alright, let's see if we can get down to... Th oh. Let's pop this out. Okay, let's see if we can get a headshot from this distance. Probably not, if anything. Dog meat, you are in my way. You're consistently still in my way. Oh, that worked. The majority of the hit. And it got stuck... Or, that's a different doe. Huh. Okay, that... Oh, shit. I missed. Okay. Well, they're not really running too fast. Let's make sure they're not running at all. There we go. Feel bad about it. Believe me. But that meat is too good to pass up. Especially when you can cook it and get, like, an extra 25 pounds added to your carry weight for, like, a limited time. Why not at that point, right? Okay. I think we're good on that. Uh, there's a junk pile over there from the look of it. There we go. Have this loaded up just on the off chance. Yeah, this is the uh, shipment that was supposed to come back. Or at least I think so. Uh, okay. That I didn't expect coming out. Oh. Okay, dog meat stuck in the, uh, uh, tracks there now. Uh, let's go for the legs. That's a lot less chance of accidentally hitting dog meat. There we go. That should do it. Perfect. Nice. Haha. <laughs> All right. Dog meat. I don't really want that. To be perfectly honest, I'd rather avoid that. Let me open this. Come here. My dog meat can open things. Why can't I open that? God damn it. But this. I open it this way. Oh! It's locked. That's probably why. Uh. Oh, come on. Let me open the thing. I'm almost there. Oh, come on. There we go. Perfect. Nice. What we got here? Oh. Oh. Yeah, you weren't going to survive, were you? Crispy squirrel bits. Okay. Well, you could have, probably, but... If you were stuck in here the whole time, that would not have gone well. I just heard him growl. Is there an enemy nearby? No. Okay. Uh, sometimes he'll growl just for the sake of growling, so I want to make sure. Okay. Well, there's nothing else in here, so 
That was kind of pointless. Well, that's another train, actually. So that might have been a shipment coming from this way as well. Oh! That's farm equipment. Must be the uh, miscellaneous thing. Maybe. I don't know. Miscellaneous does not seem right for that. Seems like something that had to be logged. Okay. We are in a different place, that's for sure. Alrighty then. Want to continue on a little bit? Yeah, that track is done for. There is no way anything's getting on this track yet again. At least until it's repaired. Alright. It's, uh... Where's the Corvegas plant? Right over there. Okay. We are pretty much there. And now the visibility cleared up. Yay! Oh, this is a place. Let's check this out for a bit. Check this out real quick. Maybe there's something useful. Maybe. Key phrase. Uh, oh, there's a cooking thing. And I my weight's pretty bad, so... Might as well try and cook it. Oh! Talk to me, you found something. What'd you find, boy? Oh, you found food. Oh, you found a machete! Oh, the shit! It's awesome! Thank you! Thank you, dog meat! It's actually really good. It's a decent melee weapon. Uh... Put that there. There we go, that'll work. Okay, I think I have two of those already, though. But oh well. Uh, bone saw and yellow fedora. Uh, I don't like the look of the yellow one. Uh, bone saw. Uh, rubber and steel. I could take that. Why not? Uh, food. Not a lot of food. It's actually kind of useless food. And vodka. Vodka. I'm going to take the vodka. Vodka is always good. Okay, red roach meat. That's worthless to me. I'm going to cook. I need to clear the enemies from this location. What does that mean? Oh, this is a location for a thing. Okay. At least now I know. Uh, grilled rad steak. Definitely cook that up. I have a bunch of that. Uh, squirrel on a stick. And I'm not going to cook up those bits if I can avoid it. I want to put them into uh, squirrel stew. If I can. Yeah. Leave that alone for now. Oh, this is a Starlight Drive-In. Is that what this was called? I need to double check real quick. Yeah, Starlight Drive-In. Yeah, this is a... This is a... Oh! Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, that almost killed me. What are you barking at? You barking at, you massive doof. Where'd you go? What'd you find... Say you found something, and then you don't tell me what you find. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That opened that right quick. Sweet. Surprise, that worked. That's definitely not what he was going for. I thought there was an extra thing. What are you barking at? Where are you, where'd you go? Where did you go? I can't even find you. Uh, oh. Oh. Well, you definitely found an enemy. That's for sure. Okay, geez. Where'd these come from? I can at least take these out in two shots with this gun, so that's good at least. Or at least the normal versions. Not the rabid. There we go. And one more shot. That did it. Okay. Oh, geez. There's more of them. There's more of them literally everywhere. Can we get a headshot on that one? Yeah, that worked. Oh, jeez. Okay, got another one. Oh, that missed? Okay, that sucks, but all right. God, there's a lot of them. Okay, it's hide and teeth. I'll take that. Because that meat's actually not as good as literally anything else. That thing's still rocking around. Uh, grab all of that. Yeah, we're good. Is there anything else going on here? Oh, that is heavy radiation coming from that spot. Uh, there's a couple mannequins set up, which means there's some other things that were set up here. Oh, 
I see another mole rat down this way. Oh, jeez. Well, I managed to get some damage on it. It's burrowing down, so he's going to pop up later. Is it going to pop up? I don't know. Whoop! Oh, right there. That's probably the spot. Come on. There we go. Ugh. That's grody. Take all that. There we go. Did that clear this up enough? Oh, there's a radio going. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Blah. I said lice first time. Ah, oh, jeez! Ah, oh, jeez, that was a makeshift bomb. Had no way of knowing that. The trap was on the inside. Oh, shit. That sucks. Ow. Uh, stim pack. And I'm gonna get rid of that radiation because I have a fuck ton of it. Uh. Where's right it? There was right away. Okay. Thank you. All gone. Nice. Whoo! That could have been bad. Oh, I'm gonna walk away. Oh! Oh, that should not have killed me like it did. Holy shit. Oh. Oh. Well, at least it saved me here. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna find out where that thing is. Before I walk forward. It has to be around that box, if anything. Uh, can I crouch? There we go. Where's the damn mine? Oh! Oh! That's a weird little glitch that's happening now, I guess. Uh, apparently when mines kill you and you spawn back, it's no longer there. It's a weird way to make it easier. A really weird way. Uh, quite personally, I would have preferred to be able to disarm the the mine the first time but I guess that's to uh, circumvent you know quickly dying after a quick save and then just respawning and dying over and over and over again but there's plenty of other ways that will screw you up in that sort of situation I don't know why they did that with mines but okay I guess I wanted the mine though <laughs> would've been useful light bulb I'll take that wanna loot this entire area since I presumably cleared all of it out. Well, you didn't survive, that's for sure. That is definitely not a good position for your neck to be in. Good lord. That's probably why you died. 10 millimeter rounds, thank you. Adjustable wrench, thank you. Casual outfit. Well, let me look at that. Oh, that's a casual woman's outfit. I assume. I don't know. <laughs> okay. It's not really... There hasn't really been much discussion on gender identity in this game. I doubt there ever will be. Because, you know, some companies want to steer clear of that. And understandably so. But, still. Not going to be wearing that. <laughs> it's not my scene. To be perfectly honest. Okay, there's a tool bench somewhere. There has to be. If, it got, if I got a prompt saying I had to clear enemies from this area, then there has to be some sort of tool bench. And I think I just found it. Ah, oh, fuck. God damn it. Can we open this? There we go. Perfect. Yes. Haha. -ha. There's a tool bench. A workshop. Hey! I just opened this of my own accord. Nice. Uh not gonna bother with this for the time being because this place is kinda yeah not great especially with that radiation in the middle there but I know you can get rid of it I know you can get rid of it but I'd rather not deal with this place entirely pipe wrench is that a weapon or a tool I don't know I don't know how that works but yeah I will definitely be getting rid of that just because 
it'll be a nuisance. Yep, get rid of that. There we go. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay, that's a lot of radiation. Okay, I don't know why that water has that much radiation. Holy shit. But you're no longer getting radiation just uh, being around it. That's for sure. And that's always good. At least I think. Uh, now it's just going through a whole bunch of things that I'm not paying attention to. Because it's not really going to be useful to me in this particular place. That and I already know how it all works. So. Just not ignore that. Uh, holy shit. That is a fuck ton of radiation. I definitely should have popped some rad axe before I dealt with that. Oh, jeez. Well, there goes another rat away. Okay. Probably not going to even take all of it. Nope. Left a tiny sliver. Oh, well. I'll just pop another stim pack. Well, that didn't even have it in my hand for that animation. That was weird. Alright, let's just clear out that other thing back here. Just going to clear this place of, well, anything really. Why is there a crib here? I just realized, why is there a crib? Okay, I guess someone once was living here. Okay. Uh, comfy pillow, I'll take that. Uh, aluminum can, definitely. It's one of the best sources of aluminum that you can easily find on your own. There we go. Grab all that. Grab that Abraxo cleaner, because that's always good. Woohoo, that's always good too. Uh, nothing there, nothing in there. Used oil can. Uh, is there anything in that? No. Uh, ooh. Some things here. There's that. Uh, adjustable wrench. Tin can. Aluminum can. Pork and beans. Fusion core. That's always good. That's always good to have. I ain't gonna turn that up. Oh, jeez. Uh. Put one bullet. And that's it. You're done. You are done. Okay. All right, that didn't even take much. Uh, fusion cell. That's nice. Uh, what we got in here? Nothing. Nothing at all. Uh, this is also useless food. Yeah, I think we just looted this entire building of anything useful that it might have had. This entire area, rather. That too. Uh, unless there's another door around here that I didn't notice. Nope, there's a thing, but it's not really a door. Radex! Yeah, that's useful. <laughs> well, about as useful as it gets. Anyway, yeah, I think we're good here. I think we're as good as we're going to get. And uh, there's no point in staying around here that much longer. So, yeah, I think we're good. I think we're as good as we're going to get. Probably going to drop off back at Sanctuary to drop the uh, junk and whatnot that we've accumulated. Probably plats plant some of the food that we gathered and then we'll head for the core plant right over there alrighty and yeah, that's another railroad thing there okay well we have also a close enough sort of waypoint to get to there so we're good alright gonna end the episode here for right now thank you all so much for watching click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video and share in comments so we can bring more people into this community we can talk about the games we're playing together and i will see y'all in the next episode this has been the one the only stray cat playing games for you